so welcome back um, to the vlog. Um, as you see on screen, I've got the Ace Grading website. Um, so last time, or two weeks ago actually now, you saw me clickbait you lot with these three rare Pokemon cards. Anyway, onwards with. So, as you can see, the parcel's back. It's been about a month, it's, it's over a month now. Um, so yeah, it's, <laughs> it's pretty big for me. And the box come back and it's got a hole in it. Um, so hopefully no, nothing of the stuff is inside is damaged. Anyway, I found a nail on the table. Um, so I'm gonna crack the tape. Uh, well, these actually came Wednesday, I believe. It's now Friday because I haven't had time to record. I've been at work and all that jazz. But I've been dying to open these all week. <laughs> so I'm actually looking forward to this. Use my massive tools. Anyway. Box is now open. And let's just see, all right? Ooh, look at that tissue foil. That's kind of mad. I didn't, I didn't expect it to be like high, high quality boxing. Ah, oh, sick. So what they've actually done, is they've done, they've done another box inside. So they're well protected. Well, you didn't think they would be. So obviously you've got all that packaging in there. Then the, the tissue foil, which I did not expect. So I'm actually impressed so far, bar the hole in the box, but. I mean, nothing's gonna happen. I didn't realize they were packaged twice. So, we're just gonna crack the seal. As you can see. Oh. All right, you ready? Because I'm not. Ooh. So, I've found, I found the, the goods. They're here, they're in the pack. The foam is now off. And I've now got these three slabs. Over here. What I'm gonna do is bang. So this is the Inferno I sent. Standard label as you can see. No idea what the grade is. But I think this is gonna be a seven. So bang. I mean, there was some scratch on it. I didn't think it would affect the grade that much, but Four. it doesn't matter at the end of the day because these are all, you know, for my personal collection. <laughs> oh, so this this is this is where the big money is. This one here. I'm hoping this is a ten. There was like a little mark in the top right that might affect the grade. So judging by. How bad that one was, I'm gonna guess this is a nine. Um, yeah, it's the same residue though, which is a bit annoying. But anyway, it's a nine. Right, so I got one right. I'm hoping for a ten though. So yeah, a nine. Happy with that one. Now, this, I think, was one of the first cards I ever bought off of eBay. So, chances are, judging by the first one, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go seven with this one. My original guess was probably, I think it was an eight, nine maybe. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna rip the band-aid off for this one. Um, six, I mean, could be worse, I suppose, but yeah. It does look quite faded though, the label. Yeah, so. Three graded cards. These are my first ever graded cards. I mean, I'm happy about this one. This one, I'm like, a bit of shit. <laughs> and then this one, I'm kind of like, ah. Because I only bought, I only paid 16 quid for these. I got this in a pack of four. So when there was a promotion at game, you have to buy like six, 15 quid worth of products. So I bought four packs. One of those four bat style packs, I got this bad boy. Um, I literally bought them after work one day. So. You know, before the YouTube times and all that. 
and they also stand up as well. Well, my overall experience with base grading has been, I'd say it's been good. Um, the customer service, I would say, I, I give it a good eight or nine, because I actually submitted four cards, and then when I was packaging them up, one of them was actually really damaged, uh, much worse than this one. So that's why I sort of, I, I emailed them and said, look, I've, I need to change it because there's no way I'm sending that in. And then they basically what they did is they were like, right, we'll just accept it this one time. So I'm very grateful for that. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to smash like that. If you are new around here as well, also make sure you subscribe. And uh, I'll see you next time. Goodbye. So obviously that wasn't all because basically since last time, I've obviously been away a bit, got longer hair, a bit more tanned since last time. Uh, and since obviously filming that video, I've actually managed to pick up three more cards. Uh, so here we have another nine Cinderace full art from Rebel Clash. I also got a Charizard Vista. Uh, I mean, this was, it wasn't underpriced, but it wasn't overpriced either. It was a, it was a fairly good deal. Also a mint nine, but that, that's not all. I also got this Cape of T T Cape of Toughness at a mint nine. And the best thing about this is I won it on an eBay auction. I guess for it, guess get, let's get a drum roll. Are ready? 10 pounds and one pen. See, obviously <laughs> I've just found out it's just stopped recording and I've just reviewed footage. And I got to the bit where I said 10 pounds and one pence, which means as it costs 10 pounds to get each card graded, Cape of Toughness from Vivid Voltage. So it's secret rare for one P. Now, if that isn't called good bargaining, don't know what it is. Um, but yeah, those are basically all I've been all I've been doing recently. So, well, anyway, that's basically all from me. If you did enjoy, be sure to smash that like button. Let's aim for a goal of two likes because I only got one in the last video, and I cried myself to sleep. If you're new, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.